All right, welcome back. It is 624 on this Friday morning. We're talking about another big event that's happening this week. We're talking about the 7th uh, Annual Antique Decoy Show and Duck Duck Goose Day. We have Andre <laughs> Uze and Claire Coco joining us now to talk about all of the fun events that are happening this weekend. Good morning to you. Happy Friday. Good morning. Good morning. Happy Friday. It's a big weekend for you guys talking about Duck Duck Do Goose Day with the Antique Decoy Show. Tell us a, bit, a little bit about what this event is all about. Uh, it's to help celebrate and spread awareness of the value uh, and collectability of, of uh, decoys that are carved in Louisiana or the entire Gulf South region. Um, a lot of people have these decoys in their families or they might have it sitting up on a mantle or in a shed out mm -hmm. back and not realize how how valuable it is as a collectible item. So this is where the collectors and carving uh, families can come together and um, help people identify or or start a collection themselves if they want to, to start their own collection. Um, we have games for kids, uh, carnival games, we have jump house, we have live duck petting. So there's a lot of fun um, for people of all ages uh, during the event. And this is all happening tomorrow from 9 until 4. Uh, and so, so this is really some of the collections, collector items that you guys are going to be getting, not just from Louisiana, but you mentioned the whole Gulf South region. Mm -hmm. Where are some, uh, some of these folks coming from? Well, we've got folks coming from Texas. We've got Arkansas, Florida, Mississippi, Alabama, Georgia, and South Carolina. And last year, we actually had some folks from New Jersey. So we bring a, a large group in. Over 1,000 folks will come through our show in that one-day uh, period. Mm -hmm. uh, and we'll have decoys that go back 100 years all the way to contemporary decoys. That's pretty amazing. And some of the money that's collected actually goes back into the community. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah. It, well, the money goes to Breck, okay. basically. <laughs> we, uh, the, the folks that come to the show, actually, as uh, Claire mentioned, it's a family fun day as well as a, a decoy show. So uh, uh, it's five dollars to uh, enter the show for adults, and uh, I think it's three, four dollars. Four dollars for, for children. children. And uh, all that money goes to Breck. It does help us to um, keep our collection up. We do have a collection that stays up year round at the at the swamp, so people can see it, um, even if they don't come on this particular event day. Um, we do have a collection that's that's viewable by the public year round. And some of these decoys that we have here on the table are actually some of the door prizes that you guys are going to be giving yes. away for folks who uh, come on out to the, uh, the to the show tomorrow. We have a lot of door prizes, um, both that we acquire in advance, but as well as as uh, supplied by the exhibitors and vendors. So there are um, the potential that people can walk away with an actual Louisiana decoy uh, if they if they luck out. Pretty amazing. Now this is all happening at the Breck Blue Bonnet Nature Swamp. Uh, where's that again for folks who want to make sure that they get out there uh, for the Blue show? Blue Bonnet Swamps at 10503 North Oak Hills, which is basically located between Perkins and Highland Roads off of uh, Blue Bonnet Boulevard. It's uh, near the Blue Bonnet Library. From 9 a.m. until 4 o'clock tomorrow, we're going to have all those fun details posted on our website, brproud.com. Good morning to you guys. Thanks so much for being with us on Thanks this Friday morning. Thank you. Hope you have a great show and we hope that everybody out there can make it out and check out some of these awesome awesome decoys all right we're going to take you. a quick break much more local 33 news today coming up after a short break